Butte Silverbow County is considering extending a boundary to ban recreational shooting near populated areas, and that's because homes could maybe get hit with some of those stray bullets. MTN's John Amy tells us how the possible change could impact those in Walkerville. Recreational shooting in the fields around the town of Walkerville, just north of Butte, may soon be a thing of the past. Years ago when I was a kid, you could just walk out behind my house over one hill and you could hunt rabbits because basically there may have been one or two ranches out there. Now, this rural area north of Daly Street is quickly developing and Butte Silverbow's Council of Commissioners is considering including this in a no shooting zone. Over the years, I think they've gotten quite a few reports of people shooting in more residential areas now than uh, you know, had ever been there before. And while safety is still the primary concern, since there's been so much development in this area north of Walkerville, still the mayor acknowledges that many people are not happy to see their traditional way of life change. Well, you know, I see actually both sides of the issue. I see the, the, the side of the people with the safety issue and worrying about their houses, you know, being shot at and, and the possibility of somebody being struck by a stray bullet. But on the other hand, I also see that the side of the people who bought property specifically to be able to go out there and have enough property to hunt on. The council will consider ending the no shooting boundary over the next few weeks. In Walkerville, John Amy, MTN News. If the commissioners adopt the new rule on shooting, it would extend about a mile north of Walkerville's town limits. And we'll be right back.